Hey guys, back to do a kind of review slash my first impressions on these. If you guys remember these from my collective haul, I apologize for your coughing, that's my brother. Because he coughs pretty bad, so I apologize for that. But yeah, these are the ones that supposedly make you look like a penguin, like you have the penguin face. I can attest that they do make it look like a penguin. As far as if it was hydrating or not, I feel like it was a, a decent amount. I mean, I don't feel like, oh wow, I have to have another one the next day type thing, but I feel like it did a pretty good job. Um, the sheet mask itself is, again, more of that cloth material. It's not a thin plastic -y type material where it's gonna tear easy. It's got, it's well saturated with the solution, so I will give it props to that. It's kind of like if you guys saw my review on the sheet masks, they got an Ipsy. It was, it's kind of like that as far as the cloth and the solution feel. I don't know why Korean or Asian sheet masks in general have more solution on them, they said made in Korea, so that's why I said Korean, but anyway. I do feel like it did help with my dry spots, like I have a dry patch here, this is about 80% gone, a dry patch here that helped, and then my nose is dry as well, and it seemed to help for those. So I guess you could say I'm having like a dry T-zone type effect, except I'm not dry here. Definitely would recommend these if you happen to see them in TJ Maxx or if you see any of the other animals. So I know they have penguin. I've seen peace, I saw Peace Sparkles do dog and panda. I think there was a yellow one, but I can't remember what the animal was. I just remember the sheet mask was solid yellow. And I think the box was a green. I think. I'll have to look through this brand and actually see. I've still got two left but I did try one yesterday and I wanted to give you guys my thoughts while it was still fresh in my head. So I still do have two. I'll show you what it looks like when you pull them out. They look like this. You just tear it right here and the sheet mask is in there. It doesn't have a funky smell or anything. So, if you're sensitive to scent, then you would probably like these. As far as if they irritated my skin or not, because I do have semi-sensitive skin, for those of you that don't know. Um, I don't feel like it irritated me at all. In fact, I think it helped some of my irritation. Because, as you guys know, I haven't actually red or face because of rosacea and eczema, you can see it's actually not that bad today. Sometimes it will go up to my forehead and down here. So I do feel like it helped with the rosacea a little bit. So if I could find these online, I might see if I can get my family to get me some for Christmas or something, but I mean, it's not bad. Definitely would get those again if I saw them in TJ Maxx, so they get an approval from me in that regard. If you guys have any more questions about the sheet masks or any of its effects, you can leave them in the comments or you can tweet them to me at Serena underscore Rosetail. I think that's what my Twitter handle is. I know it's in the, if you look at my channel. I have it in the corner where it shows the icons you can click on to go to my social media accounts. So yeah, you can either ask below or tweet them to me and I will get back to you as soon as I can. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. I will talk to you guys in another video another time. Bye guys.